just got back from getting coffee. It's Monday, it's 11-11, make a wish. Jory and I are trying to get out of the apartment more often, so we have a couple of different coffee shops that have opened up in our area. So we're trying to walk to <clears throat> different coffee shops a couple of times throughout the week, not every day, because that's expensive. <laughs> Today, I tried something different. I got a fig latte, it's delicious. I am currently making a video alongside vlogging. <laughs> I don't know how that's going to go, but I'm trying to um, figure out a good work from home schedule because I have to work eight hours a day, but then I also am trying to like vlog and create content and also like paint. Yesterday was a really good day. I just woke up and painted all day. I painted in my sketchbook. I listened to Sorry About My Birds. I listened to artist talks and it was just really nice. I did that all day. I didn't film a single second of it because I was just like in the zone. This is my cat. See, it's really gloomy right now. Again, we're just not getting rid of the gloominess. Jordan has like five meetings today, so. That's gonna be fun for her. mentioned at the start of the vlog that um, yesterday I spent the day painting in my sketchbook and watching like artist talks and many artist documentaries so um, while I'm on my two three hour break from work I just put on this um, video i don't know what to call these from art 21 if they're like art documentaries like mini art documentaries mini art films mini i don't know i don't know what to call them but um i picked out one a video from richard misrock i'm not like familiar with his work as far as i know um, i'm not great at keeping up with artist names <laughs> honestly but um there's this shot that I want to try to not recreate but like take the colors from um so I'm gonna watch this while I wait for this to dry and then take some inspiration from some of these different settings with like the colors and and the light um and the landscape and play around with that in the sketchbook
<clears throat> okay, dishwasher is going in the background. So cool. <clears throat> it's Wednesday. It's 10 o'clock. I just clocked in. Yeah, I don't know how much painting I'm gonna get done today. Let's see. I didn't paint at all yesterday. I enjoyed my like relaxation time so much from work work that I was like, why would I do something else right now? So maybe that's a problem. That I'll address at a later time. Good afternoon. Happy Thursday. It's one. I just, actually I haven't clocked out yet. I'm on break from work right now. Jordan made lunch. It's a very abundant stir fry. Um, yeah, so I've been pretty bad at vlogging this week. I feel like it was really good on Monday. And, um, and now it's Thursday. So I've been, I think part of, hold on, I'm gonna take these off. I can't really see now, but it's fine. Um, I feel like part of the reason is that I was kind of doing like a double vlog this week. Um, I am doing this regular studio vlog that I normally do, but then also this week I've been trying out, um, like a different schedule. So I have, I have it marked down. This video will be coming out on Wednesday. I have to figure out how to edit it now because I feel like I kind of, I feel like I've kind of found the schedule that works best for me. It's just a matter of, I'll talk about this more in that video, but basically I'm trying to find this balance between like work for myself and then work for like the company that I work for and also like taking time to relax and take care of myself and you know like nurture my relationships so be like um are you trying to open the door quietly huh are you trying to open the door quietly yeah <laughs> <laughs> on a one hour break so I probably won't get all the paint and stuff out, but I might prep some some papers to work on, because um, I've been thinking about the next collection that I'm going to release, and I think it's going to be mostly work on paper. I think it's going to be entirely work on paper. I've been working on my sketchbook a lot, and I still have some work to do. Penny's like eating my chair. Um, I still have some work to do before I really figure out. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to do a FaceTime call when you're done. I just totally blanked. Actually, I'm gonna go back here. No, I'll talk about this later. It's okay. Uh, no. Hello, me again, same angle. Two, three hours later? Three hours later. Fake latte. I don't remember what I was saying earlier. Uh, I was talking about art, talking about uh, how I need to work in my sketchbook some more. I kind of have like an idea of what, I know like what I want to paint, but I don't know exactly how I want to go about painting it. I'm starting to paint in like a different way or I'm a, like approaching painting in a different way I don't know everything that I've painted over the last couple weeks has been very different or has been painted very differently like these two I'll like show better clips but these two were painted kind of in a similar way but then this was painted kind of differently and then this is painted extremely differently. And then <laughs> this was just, this was just, I needed to cover this up and then I had paint that I had to use and then it was like still wet, but I needed to use the paint. So it just ended up how it ended up. And then this is kind of like, I'm trying to continue off of what I did 
here because there's something happening here that I like but there's also something happening here in here that I like that one is difficult to combine because they're painted on different surfaces like they're both painted on paper but one the paper is like primed with gesso and the other one it isn't so it absorbs the paint differently I don't know. Also, I'm using different color palettes than I'm used to because I'm trying to take more inspiration from like nature and the sky um, specifically so the color palettes aren't as spontaneous um, and like self-driven as they normally are. Normally I just kind of decide as I go, but um, painting based off of something that already exists, like the color palette is already it's like predetermined so that's a different way of painting for me um, it's a challenge that I'm trying to like adjust to that I want to adjust to um, but it's still an adjustment so I would like to work in the sketchbook a little bit more but I also really just want to try to paint on paper it's not going to happen today <laughs> I have a lot more work that I have to get done today it's just I'm just not gonna paint today I'm just not gonna paint today but I want to paint really badly so tomorrow um, I have to see, I have a meeting with my boss at some point tomorrow so I have to <laughs> fit my schedule around that I might just paint on Saturday and Sunday and make them big painting days because we're not supposed to have too much planned this weekend but like, I don't know. <laughs> oh, also, I did a little um, poll what kind of content um, you like to watch. Um, unsurprisingly, most people voted for vlogs. I think that just makes sense because I make vlogs currently, so most of my audience watches vlogs. But um, you can go vote if you want me to take your opinion into consideration when I plan content because I'm trying to do two uploads a week if that ends up being entirely unsustainable then I'll do like two uploads every other week and one upload every other week you know um but we'll see I can batch filming days Think about us, I think about us calling I think about us, I think about us falling Through the dark night and through time Towards the light when you'll be mine I think about us, I know the dawn is for us I dream about us, I dream about the stars
Hello, it is Sunday. Um, and I'm just gonna end the vlog here. I was planning on painting today, but I think that finishing up editing this vlog is going to take probably the rest of my day. The um, last thing that I was working on were these studies that I'm actually really excited about, but I ended up finding this like, mixed media paper that I spilled gesso once all over my bag and it got all over this. Not really sure about this paper, but it, um, the paint sits on it differently than it does in the sketchbook. It doesn't absorb in the same kind of way because it's um, like a smoother, less absorbent surface. So I feel like that's kind of what I was looking for when I was like trying to combine the two different different like elements that I was getting in my sketchbook, like with the page that was primed and the page that wasn't primed. This is sort of like the in-between of those two. So I worked on these three on camera and then finished this one. And this I think is kind of getting where I want to go. It's like a combination of like, it's like the improved version of this one. I feel like you can kind of tell. So um, if I do have time to paint today, I will probably do more of these studies, um, which I will film and then put in the next vlog. We talked a lot about art in this vlog and process, um, which was interesting because I haven't talked about that in a really long time. It was like art school again, which was weird. Um, so expect more of that in the next vlog probably because I'm still figuring a lot of things out and we'll be in the sketchbook a lot more and maybe doing more of these. So more of that next week. Not sure if the schedule video is ever going to go up because I have no idea how to put that together. But we'll see. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you again very soon.